into our meditation posture. <clears throat> and just however it is you're turning up this evening, just know that it's totally fine. And check your, if your feet are on the floor, on the ground, just try and make contact with the earth through the soles of your feet. Really get a sense of that. If you're sitting cross-legged on um, a cushion or a meditation seat, you can feel your sits bones. And you can raise them slightly. It's Carlos. Okay. Welcome, Carlos. <laughs> okay. Thank you for showing yourself. We've had some bombers, that's why we're a little bit careful. Where was I? Shoulders are aligned with the hips. And imagine your spine is a string of pearls of light and it's stretching from the base all the way up through the crown of the head and beyond. So your spine is lengthening. Putting some space in between those vertebrae. Imagine you have a, a string of pearls is going out through the top of the crown of your head and it's just lengthening. So you're getting a little bit longer, taller. And just from the very top of the head, I mean from the top of where the head rests on the spine, just hinge there at the top of the neck and just drop your chin down a little bit not too far down. If your eyes were open, you'd be looking at a spot ahead of you, a couple of inches. Relax the jaw. Move your jaw around a bit. Take a nice deep breath. Make sure you're breathing. I think um, I know what I do very frequently when I'm in front of the computer is I just stop. I don't. I don't breathe for a few seconds. You know. I think they've done some studies to show that people's breathing is just a little bit disrupted when they're in front of the computer. So we're on the Zoom, so just make sure you're still breathing regularly. And bring your awareness to the crown of the head and relax your scalp and the forehead, the eyes, the nose, the cheeks the area around the mouth, the jaw, back of the tongue, the back of the head. Just release any tension there. Relax the ears, the inner ear, the jaw again. Back of the, back of the tongue. Just keep bringing your mind back. We just hold so much tension in this area. We're using our tongue for talking a lot. Cleansing our jaw and ting. <clears throat> Relax the back of the neck. Allow your shoulders to drop down. Relax the throat, the chest, the belly, and all your limbs. And then just go back again and check your spine. You haven't slumped. You just want to be nice and nice and aligned. And just bring your attention to the air as it's flowing in and out of your nostrils. If there's any sounds in your environment, just allow those sounds to be there.
And then just notice what thoughts are arising in the mind and try not to criticize or judge. Try not to have any opinions about what's going on in the mind. Try not to let your mind get wrapped up in a story. Just keep the mind on the breath and just observe what's there. And then you can bring to mind all these people of our life, our loved ones, our dear ones, our friends, the ones we have a bit difficulty with right now, and then our strangers. What I find interesting myself is the, the ones that I love are generally pretty stable. The ones that I get a little bit irritated or feeling a little bit uncomfortable around, that just seems to fluctuate the most for me. And I wonder if it's the same, which group, which group tends to move around for you most. I don't find the ones in the, the so-called enemy group stay there very long, it's interesting shows how fickle my mind is. So we can also see how unstable our minds are. So the point is to try, try and develop equal affection. And we're always going to have karmically stronger relationships with some people than others. But equal kindness, equal affection towards everyone. Because we are all equal and I wish to be happy and I wish to be free from suffering and in having this unbelievable capacity for an enlightened mind. So just bringing to mind that there is no negativity that cannot be purified. And this purification process is basically a psychological one. So we create negativity with our mind so we can equally create positivity with our mind instead. So, so think sincere regret from the depths of your heart. Anything you have done to harm any living being on this day, in this life, and in all past lives and think of specific actions of both your body and your speech, and then in general regret all. And the reason to regret is based on this logic of karma. When we experience everything due to our past karma, our past actions, and having harmed others, we ourselves will necessarily experience suffering in the future. We cannot bear the thought of the future suffering that we ourselves will experience, and so we know from the present suffering we don't want it. So logically it makes sense that we would remove the karmic seeds before they ripen as future suffering for us. So think like this, I regret from the depths of my heart, having harmed others with my body and my speech, having broken my vows, because I do not want the future suffering, I'm sick of suffering. And also regret any anger, attachment and the rest that are the cause of why we harm others and think I'm sick of this suffering. And then think, what can I do about it? Whom can I turn to? So here we come to the power of reliance. We rely upon, we turn to the Buddha, who has the methods that we can use to purify. And we're not needing the Buddha to forgive us, we're purifying ourselves by relying upon his methods. So imagine Vajrasattva above the crown of your head, and you can also imagine this is your teacher manifesting in this form for your benefit. And he's made of radiant, blissful, white 
light. He has a beautiful face. And he's looking at you very lovingly. He's very happy to see you. He is sitting cross-legged on a white lotus. His eyes are long, shaped like lotus petals. He has a sweet red mouth. His hair is black and held up in a top knot. His arms are crossed at his heart, the left underneath the right. The right is um, the left is holding a bell representing wisdom, and the right is holding a vajra, which represents the indestructibility of compassion. And there being crossed represents union of these two, which symbolizes enlightenment itself, the development of infinite wisdom and infinite compassion. To the Buddha, the Dharma, and the Sangha, I go for refuge until I'm enlightened. By this practice of meditating on Guru Vajrasattva, may I reach Buddhahood so as to benefit all sentient beings. So in order to develop compassion, we need to rely upon other beings, the very beings we have harmed, and those who have harmed us by developing compassion for them. So think particularly of someone you may have harmed recently, and in the past, and then in general, all beings we have ever harmed since beginningless time. We make a strong aspiration to do this practice of purification for the sake of all these sentient beings and think, I must purify for their sake. So this is the power of the remedy, the actual medicine, and this is the doing the practice of purification. So we start with the body, and Vajrasattva now very compassionately sends powerful white nectar light coming out of a hose quite forcefully from his heart and it arcs around and enters your crown and pours into your entire body filling you completely and it keeps pouring into you until it forces out of your lower orifices all the harm you have ever done to any living being with your body in the form of inky liquid and this pours out of you and disappears into space not one atom left as you recite the mantra Om Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Mebawa Sutokaya Mebawa Supokaya Mebawa Anarakta Mebawa Sawa Siddhi Mepiyata Sawa Kama Sutta Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sata Ahum Pe Om Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Mebawa Sutokaya Mebawa Supokaya Mebawa Anarakta mebo a sawa siddhi me piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra me mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. Am vajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Dida me bo a sutokaya me bo a supokaya me bo a. Anarakta me bo a sawa siddhi me piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra. Vajra mami mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. Am vajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Dida me bawa sutokaya me bawa supokaya me bawa. Anarakta me bawa sawa siddhi min piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mami mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. Am vajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Dida me bawa sutokaya me bawa supokaya me bawa. Anarakta me bawa sawa siddhi min piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mami mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. Am vajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Dida me bawa sutokaya me bawa supokaya me bawa. Anarakta me bawa sawa siddhi min piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mami mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. Am vajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Dida me bawa sutokaya me bawa supokaya me bawa. Anarakta me bawa sawa siddhi min piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mami mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum. Pay. Then be delighted that all the harm you've ever done to any sentient being with your body is now completely purified and think there's no way you could do anything but benefit others now with the body. And the next is a purification of your speech. And Vajrasattva very happily sends powerful nectar from his heart chakra 
and it arcs around and forcefully enters your crown, filling your entire body, except this time forcing up to the top of your body all the negativity of your speech. And this overflows and disappears into space, not one atom left. So it's just the same as when you uh, turn on a tap in the sink and you fill that dirty glass up, all the junk in the glass comes to the top and overflows. But Lama Zoprimashe says it overflows quite powerfully. So it almost could be almost as forceful as the wind blowing a hat off the top of your head. So you just imagine all the gossip and the harsh speech and the useless speech and lying, talking badly about others behind their backs, getting other people to agree with you. All of this is purified by this powerful nectar filling you as you recite the mantra. Om Vajra Sapta Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapta Dina Patita Dita Mebawa Sutokaya Mebawa Supokaya Mebawa Anarakta Mebawa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sutam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pe Om Vajra Sapta Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapta Dina Patita Dita Mebawa Sutokaya Mebawa Supokaya Mebawa Anarakta me bawa sawa siddhi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mame mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. Am vajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Dida me bawa sutokaya me bawa supokaya me bawa. Anarakta me bawa sawa siddhi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pe Am Vajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Duda Me Bawa Sutokaya Me Bawa Supokaya Me Bawa Anarakta Me Bawa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shri Am Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pe Am Vajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Duda Me Mebawa sutokaya mebawa supokaya mebawa anarakta mebawa sawa siddhi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan sawa tata gata vajra mame mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe am vajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita duda mebawa sutokaya mebawa supokaya mebawa Anarakta me bawa sawa siddhi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mame mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. Am vajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Duda me bawa sutokaya me bawa supokaya me bawa. Anarakta me bawa sawa siddhi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mame mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. So again, feel so happy that your speech is now completely purified and imagine it's not possible to do anything but benefit others now with your speech. So the next is a purification of the mind, and Vajrasattva now very compassionately sends powerful beams of light from his heart chakra, and this arcs around and enters your crown and fills your entire being. So again, just remembering every time you walk into a room and you switch on a light, just think that light is dispelling the darkness. So the same. The moment the light from Vajrasattva's heart hits your heart chakra, all the darkness of the negativity of your mind, so all your attachment and neediness and grasping and anger and depression, resentment, anxieties, jealousies and bitternesses and grudges, all of this is instantly dispelled as you recite the mantra. Om Bajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Bajra Sapa Dina Patita Dida Me Bawa Sutokaya Me Bawa Supokaya Me Bawa Anarakta Me Bawa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hum Pe Am Bajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Bajra Sapa Dina Patita Dida Me Bawa Sutokaya Me Bawa Supokaya Me Bawa Anarakta me bawa sawa siddhi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mame mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. 
Bajasapa Samaya Manupalaya Bajasapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajama Mimutsa Vajabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Bajasapa Samaya Manupalaya Bajasapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum, ha 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 ho, bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. Vajra sapa samaya manupalaya, vajra sapa dina patita. Dira meboa, sitokaya meboa, sipokaya meboa. Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum, ha 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 ho, bhagawan. Sawa tata gata Vajra Mame Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hompe Ambaja Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hompe Ambaja Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Dida meboa, sutokaya meboa, sipokaya meboa, anorakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum, ha 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 ho, bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajra mame mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. So be delighted that all the delusions, which are the source of all of all of our own suffering and the cause of why we harm others with our body and our speech are completely purified. And think now, there is no space in your heart for anything other than love and kindness and forgiveness and wisdom and bliss and compassion. So next is the purification of even the imprints of negativity of body, speech and mind. So imagine Bhajasattva very happily sends light and nectar filling you completely and eradicating even the subtlest imprints of negative energy from your mind as you recite the mantra. Om Bajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Bajra Sapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe Bajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Bajra Sapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum, ha 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 ho, bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mame mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. Ambajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Dida meboa, sutokaya meboa, sipokaya meboa. Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum, ha 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 ho, bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mame mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. Vajra sapa samaya manupalaya, vajra sapa dina patita. Tira meboa, sutokaya meboa, sipokaya meboa. Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum, ha 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 ho, bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mame mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. Vajra sapa samaya manupalaya, vajra sapa dina patita. Dira meboa, sutokaya meboa, sipokaya meboa. Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum, ha 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 ho, bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mame mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. Vajra sapa samaya manupalaya, vajra sapa dina patita. Dira meboa, sutokaya meboa, sipokaya meboa. Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum, ha 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 ho, bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajra mame mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. So now feel you're completely purified. Not one atom of negativity left in your mind stream. Even the subtlest obscurations to your enlightenment have been removed. So now we come to the power of resolve, and this is the fourth step in the purification process. And it's a really crucial one, this 
decision we make to refrain from harming with our body and our speech and our mind. So again, come back to something that you've been working on maybe for the last year or two or just even week. Maybe it's the your wisdom. Maybe it's the speech, knowing the right thing to say at the right time, when to keep your mouth firmly shut. And give yourself a, a reasonable task and a reasonable timeline. Nothing too big to start with, nothing too challenging. We just give ourselves small steps. Small challenges overcome successfully. Works a lot better for our mind than not quite managing to do a large task that we overestimated. So Vajrasattva is delighted with us and wanting to merge with your mind melts into white light and absorbs into you through your crown and think, my guru's body, speech and mind, Vajrasattva's body, speech and mind, and my own body, speech and mind are the same thing. And next, Rinpoche recommends to meditate on the emptiness of the three circles. In emptiness, there is no I, the creator of negative karma. There is no action of creating negative karma. And there is no negative karma created. So at whatever level you understand emptiness, place your mind there for a little while. You can think of all phenomena as being empty. They do not exist from their own side. And you can also think that the way things appear to me may not necessarily be the way they exist. So let's just dedicate all the merit, all the positive energy you've created by doing this purification to all living beings and think, may all the virtuous karma I've created from doing this practice ripen as my enlightenment for the sake of sentient beings as quickly as possible. And we'll do our long life prayers so our teachers hopefully will stay around for as long as possible. His Holiness, the wish-granting, wish-fulfilling jewel, source of every single benefit and happiness in this world, to the incomparably kind Tenzin Gyatso, I beseech, may all your holy wishes be spontaneously fulfilled. Om Palamsa Parampashe. Tub Shu Chang Jin Jam Gan Galloway. Tenzin Kyong Pel away, corns a dog poor zay. Chog sum kur away, leg mon to droop. Pa dog sog dulage, gon du jab ten chog. And for Lama Ursul, Venerable One, to you whose kindness succeeds out of all the conquerors, for those wanderers in far off places, especially the West, mindful of your loving concern for us and intentionally descending again into a family of a far distant land, we make this request, O Lama, please, please live long. I forget you share a beloved teacher leading your students toward wisdom and compassion, Explaining through exacting discernment the steps of the graduated path, you are the unequal guide. Please live a long and stable life. Okay, everybody. Thank you all for coming. Nice to see you all. And have a wonderful weekend. It's another holiday, right? President's Day. <laughs>